Hi, this is Andrew with PandaComputers.com and welcome to our video series on Windows XP. We're talking about the 12 basic commands every computer user should know. This is video 11 and we're going to talk about briefly once again saving things or saving documents. Now the reason why I want to talk about saving stuff is because I have too many people that turn around and don't save stuff. They'll, they'll go into their Word or something. Let's go ahead and go into Microsoft Word here and they will uh, let me find it here for a second. Microsoft Office, Word, there we go. They'll start a document or something like that. They won't save it, and then <coughs> something happens. The computer crashes, it gets closed, and it's gone. Okay. So save that document, save it, save it. So I've opened a document, and the first thing I want to do is I want to save it. So I'm going to go up here to the left, uh, upper left-hand corner here. I'm going to click on Save, and I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to just save it as uh, document one is fine and hit save. Now that I've saved it and I've named the document up here, there are three basic ways that I can save this document. And you want to save often. Now yes, Word has an auto save, but it only saves about every 10 minutes. So how can we do that? Well the first one is just go up here. Once I've named the document, all I have to do is go up to this little this little uh, icon right here and just click save. Okay. So if I'm typing along, da 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 and I hit enter a couple of times, da 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 I grab the mouse, click, it saved the document. Now you'll notice down here it'll flash really quick. Now I, I'm going to click up here and I want you to watch down here really quickly. I'm going to type a little bit more, okay? And then down here I'm just going to click save really quick. And you'll see it kind of flash a little bit there. Boom, it's saved. So I can just do a quick save there. I can also go back up here and I can click save again here. That's the second way to do it. And the third way, which is really convenient, is I can use the keyboard. Now since I'm already typing, all I have to do is a simple little command, which is control. Let me type it here. Control plus the S key or control shift. Okay. Now if you go up here and I uh, look on this icon here, see right there it says save, control shift. See that little thing right below there? That's a quick one. Now if you get in the habit of doing that as you type, you can type along for a while and then you see the control and the shift key. You'll see the cursor flash for a second and it saves it again. It's that simple. Now, if this program gets shut down or whatever it is, I can go right back into my documents here. I'm going to pull right up Doc 1. And boom, there it is. It's saved. So save that document. Save it when you open it. Save it before you start it. Save it before you even title your page. And then save often. There's quick ways to do it. You can use the Control S. You can do the quick save up here. Or you can click File and Save here but save it, save it, save it. Now, sometimes I'll save multiple copies of it, okay? Why do I do that? Well, maybe I did the rough draft, and I'll save it. And then I'll go in and do some modifications, and I'll save it as maybe document two or something. So let's just say example here. I wrote a rough draft of a couple of paragraphs here, but I'm not sure if I want to really go this way, and I'm going to make some changes. So I'll go up here again, and I'll just hit save as, which means I want to change the name. I'm going to call it document. 1-1 because it's, it's going to be a change. I'm going to hit save again. Now I've saved my original document. Now I can go in and edit it and I don't have to worry about it. If I get halfway through it and decide I don't want it, I can go back to the original document. Please, please, please people, learn how to save. Learn the control plus the S key. Learn to click up here really quick. Even right clicking on some programs, not Word, but on some programs, right click you can save. Um, but there's, you know, there's three different ways here to save quickly and easily. Save your documents multiple times while you're using them. It doesn't matter if it's Word or you're making a poster or a picture or whatever it is. Save that document, save that photo, save that diagram, save what it is, and it'll save you from lots of headaches and pains when something happens and you'll lose all that hard work. This has been Andrew with Panda Computers. Have a great day.